in the name of God. After saying hi to all my dear friends and partners, we are going to continue and complete our previous videos about license plate recognition. This part, we are going to explain some points about the configuration of plate recognition cameras. We hope that this video can be useful and applicable for you. If you can remember, plate recognition cameras should show a good image, but we mentioned that high resolution is not a good parameter in having a clear and high quality image. What is important is a good and clear image taken by a camera at night and having a high resolution doesn't matter here. In other words, a good image can be a beautiful crystal image in a default or normal condition, but it doesn't mean it can be an optimal image in place recognition projects. Sometimes, advertising films or videos are shown in social networks, groups or channels, which the vehicle is parked on the street or is coming out of the parking in a slow speed. But these films can't be classified in the plate recognition images, because we should be able to observe and read the license plate clearly in moving or sometimes high speed. Accordingly, first we go to basic setting, from configuration part and choose image, and then go to day or night mode tab. We we'll start from minimum and maximum shutter choices that empirically are 1 over 1000 for night mode and 1 over 750 for day mode for being in the best condition. Now let's see how the image is. It seems the image has got worse and certainly it's not optimal for us because by increasing the number of the shutter, less light gets into the image sensor of the camera and the noise is highly increased. Having a light source for precise observing of plate is really essential. For this purpose, white LED projector can significantly help us. Therefore, in most places, there are some light source stands which can be seen about 15 meters before the plate recognition cameras. But in some places, not possible to provide enough light in the shutters more than 250 numbers per second. So, plate recognition in night mode is the best option for us. Here, we should figure the setting in the case that infrared of cameras and its reflection from the plate can solve our problem. Therefore, for this purpose, we go to configuration part again and by image menu, we go to display tab. In IR light sensor value part, as you can see, the number displayed of light environment is 98% here. We should set the light rate according to the camera environs, so that in darkness, the image changes to night mode automatically. But if the light is enough, this change is not often made automatically. So, you could do it manually. But one of the defects of this camera figuration state is that it will be set on a night mode forever and it doesn't change to day mode in a days. However, if the camera is always on night mode, plate recognition is still done correctly. But as a rule, color image gives us a better feeling in days. Anyway, there is another option by choosing customized in day or night mode tab to set a time so that the camera can be switched from day mode to night mode or vice versa on a specific time. Now, we save it on a night mode to see the feedback on this action. Well, let's see the change of the image quality of the license plate recognition. Oh, it still seems it's not optimal in the plate recognition. Therefore, exposure level should be set according to our environs. For this purpose, we go to configuration, image and then day or night mode tab again. And next we change the number of exposure levels to 3 and we save the change. Then we check the live video once more. This time the image seems better but unfortunately it's not a good image in LPR yet. So. We go to setting part one more and for exposure level we choose number one this time.
Now it seems the image has better quality and this image can be compatible with all PR softwares. I think it's a good idea to show you one of the films in our archive to feel the tangible difference. In my opinion, this is an amazing image. Indeed, it's recommended to clarify your customers the point that the license plate recognition camera is supposed to read only the plates. Sometimes it's usual that we are criticized by partners to ask why the driver is not clear in this image or why the image is so dark. Well, when you are reading plates by infrared, the camera is responsible to display a good image to read the plates. If you want to have an image from the environs, you should install another type of camera. A camera even with a wider angle and colored image. For this reason, most LPR softwares are accompanied with a supplemental camera when they are active, a license for LPR. It's a good idea to talk about one of the important possibility of frameworks of mild side cameras too. In these frameworks, you can set and see the minimum and maximum of shutters in different time and hour of the day. WDR and HLC also have the same possibilities, but related information about them will be given in the next videos. Maybe it has occurred that a camera is not able to read the plates correctly in a special time like sunrise or sunset. Therefore, you can set the timer for instance on 5 to 7 o'clock. and choose the right numbers for exposure level minimum and maximum shutters. Next, save the changes. Now, you can see some images from plate recognition camera. We hope that this video can also be useful and informative for you. We wish you have a good time and be in the support and protection of God. Thank you.